outside of knows. Um, it's becoming fall. Like it's it's Thursday and it's a fall Thursday. I'm so excited. Um, but thinking about fall has me thinking about a couple things. Um, one of them being corn mazes. Now I'm from Indiana technically. Um, I mean I moved around a lot, but Indiana's where I live the longest. And in Indiana we know corn. We have corn. Basically all we have is corn and car racing and the Colts. It's clearly an alliterative theme going on here. But corn. <clears throat> so I have friends who always want to go to the corn maze out here and they're like, it'll be so fun. We should go to the corn maze. And I'm always like, mm, no thanks. And then they're always like, you don't like corn mazes? Why don't you like corn mazes? And I'm like, I do like corn mazes, but they have to be good corn mazes. And then I feel like a corn maze snob, which is not always the most fun thing. But I'm from Indiana and corn is like our thing. And so corn mazes in Indiana are awesome because the corn grows really tall. Like, I mean, it's always at least six feet tall. I swear, like every time I've gone, it's definitely taller than me and it's like dense so you can't like see through it or like cheatery way like cut through the corn to get out of the corn maze no 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 you have to go through it plus because there's so many corn fields uh corn mazes are fairly popular and they're well done and they're pretty inexpensive um in comparison to the corn mazes i've been to out here uh in you know utah land so i was talking to somebody and they're like we're gonna go to corn maze aren't you excited and i'm like no, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna go. I'm just gonna stay home because I don't wanna pay 12 bucks for a corn maze that's not even haunted where the corn is shorter than I am and you can see through it. I just can't do it. It's like, it's like how I feel about going to Panda Express. I'm not gonna pay expensive Chinese food prices for crappy, cheap, like Chinese food that's not even real Chinese food. I just can't do it. And yeah, I been kind of going back and forth with my roommate about it recently because she really loves corn mazes and she's like no they're awesome it'll be so fun and I'm like I can't I just can't I don't know how to explain it to people outside of the fact that Indiana's corn mazes are super awesome and I never thought I'd miss anything about Indiana but if I did fall would probably be one of those things because corn mazes and the colors of the leaves like they change really well there you get like a longer fall in Indiana than you get in Utah because Utah is like oh this is fall oh now it's cold winter snow you're gonna hate everything about every day when you go outside and then it's summer again like we don't get spring or fall here really and in Indiana you get more of them uh, so I kind of miss fall though it being fall now I have officially allowed myself to eat pumpkin things and to wear a sweater and it's been nice I'm excited for fall. Also, uh, pretty much our year anniversary. So happy year anniversary! All good things start in the fall. Okay, maybe not all good things, but a lot of them. Anyway, if you find a good corn maze around here, let me know, and maybe I'll go to that. But it has to be less than ten bucks, and preferably haunted. If I'm gonna pay ten bucks for it. Anyway, keep being authentically awesome.